Um, Rocco, are you looking for this? Oh, Anya, hi, yeah. Uh, wait, you had that the whole time? I broke into like 16 forks trying to get into this thing. Whoa, it sounds like you're super excited to see what today's puzzle is. Oh, yeah, you bet. I've read my Bible a whole bunch to be ready. That's amazing. Do you remember reading the word communion in there? Communion, yeah, that sounds familiar. That's awesome, because communion is today's key. What do you remember reading about it? Well, I think it's something that Jesus did with the disciples. That's right. Jesus told his disciples to take communion to remember how he died for us. Oh, that's cool. But when we have communion, it's always with crackers and juice. What do those things have to do with Jesus dying on the cross? Great question, buddy. Luke 22, 19 says that Jesus took bread, gave thanks, and gave it to them, saying, this is my body given for you. Do this in remembrance of me. Oh, yeah. That's coming back to me now. I think the juice represents his blood, which is kind of icky if you think about it. But Rocco, both the juice and the bread are meant to be symbols, and symbols are like reminders. Yeah, I do forget things a lot, like what I ate for breakfast and when I last took a bath. God must have known that when he gave us reminders for important things. Exactly, and what Jesus did for us is so important that we need to make sure we never forget it. Now Rocco, I hope your memory is feeling extra sharp for this next puzzle. Oh, I'm ready! This looks like a tough one, but remember, our clue is that communion is key. Oh, and communion is a symbol. A symbol to help us remember... To take a bath. Wait, no, that's not right. That God loves us and sent Jesus. And because of Jesus' love and sacrifice, he has to be first. Oh, oh, I got it. Communion is for us to remember that God is first. Whoa, Rocco, you've got mad skills. Thanks, Anya. I may forget some things, but I never want to forget that Jesus died for me and that God is first. That's it. And kids, communion is not just for adults. It's for everyone who follows Jesus. That's right. If you've accepted Jesus in your heart, then communion is one of the ways that you can keep God first. Rocco, I'm so proud of you. You did so great today. Yeah, that was fun. I wonder what the next puzzle will be. Well, you'll have to wait till next time, my friends. And I'm sure the kids would love to help. Yeah, we can't wait to see you guys again. Bye! Bye. Excited, get up, get up, get up, and repeat after me. Matthew 6, verse 33. Matthew 6, verse 33. For it is. But seek first. By grace, seek first. first. You have his kingdom and his righteousness. Been saved, his kingdom, kingdom and his righteousness. righteousness. And all these things. And all these and things, and this things is not will be given to you as well. Yourselves will be given, will be given to, to you as well. It is the gift of God. <gasps> you did so great! Ooh, excellent! Good job, my friends! I will see you guys again next time, but until then, bye!